Hey, what up, ShootTube? This is Mo Butters back again on the Stone Cold Kicks channel, and we got another sick, lit beater box battle for you today. We got two Soul Supremacy boxes right here, and we're gonna get them popping beater box style. So, as always, this is Mo Butters and Rock'em Stock'em Kicks in the house, man. You know how we do it. We keep these beater box battles popping two at a time, all mm -hmm. the time. These are mystery boxes. We have no idea of the contents, but we know the price. The price I paid for this box was 450 bucks. This one was a little different. Yeah, this one was 540. So 450 versus 540. Mm -hmm. There's about a $100 price difference. His box should have a little bit better contents, but mine was a little cheaper. So you could go ahead and think about all the contents and drop a comment which box you think won this yeah, Peter we'll Box see. battle. Man, I was so excited to get this box today. Last week I missed my packs, man, and it came early, and I had to wait till Monday to get my stuff. So yeah, UPS, you always gotta work around them. You got to. I was at work, and I was just, I was mad the whole weekend. Man. And then they drop it off at this uh, this cleaners, just a UPS access point. So yeah. I had to go pick it up from there. So this is a better weekend. Somebody sitting boxes. there with your box, you don't know what they do. Right, I don't like that, man. The whole weekend I was on edge, man. So, got a bunch of Lucy's. I'm gonna have to let you Luce start. Ville. Luceville, yeah. Illinois. Right. Damn. I'm gonna get it cracking, man. I got you start in Luceville. Yeah. So I got some uh, Cyber Monday three, Jordan threes. What size are these? Eleven and a half. The Peter Box staple, popular size. Yeah. But these definitely go with a lot. Go with both of our uh, fits we got on. Right, that's a definite beater box staple because we get yeah. not only 11 and a half all the time, all but we the time. actually get a lot of Cyber Monday threes. They got right. a couple pairs, so yeah. So these just floating around, but they in good use condition. All the stars on the bottom, and uh, not much going on with these, but these are good to go, man. So. All right, man. got the Cyber Monday three Lucy's. I have no Lucy's, so man. that's that's how I'm doing it today. I got a 10 and a half. Yeah, Let's see some Nikes. Man. Orange box. We got these though. We got hyper some hyper chase. chases. Yeah, these are like the James Harden. I right. believe they were. They were James Harden. I forget that. I think that's a Black History Month colorway. Right. It's funky colorway. I think I, it, if, if I it's not Black it. History Month, it's maybe a All Star game. But it says it's NCS. Yeah. Yep. I forget what. It, oh, that's Net Society uh, Collection. Net. It's, that's what it is. Net Collector Society. That's what it is. It should be on the inside of the shoe. Yeah. Net Collector Society. So basically, it was like a March Madness uh, um, thing that they had going on during that year. They had a bunch of other shoes that was Net Collector Society. Basically, when you cutting down the nets mm -hmm. in the NCAA. So that's what this was. When this was like a March Final Madness Four. thing, right? This was a March Madness theme. They did like the Nike Hyper. They did a lot of other basketball shoes that was like this. the Hyper Rev and stuff like that. So it's got a whole bunch of colors on it. Got the 3M swoosh. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Got another 3M swoosh on the inside. The lacing system is pretty funky on these. Right. Off to the side, the asymmetrical type of design. And these are the 10 and a half and they're very good worn condition. They're worn like one time only, just a little bit of dirt on the bottom. 10 and a half, James Harden Hyper Chase. Let me know if you need them. Yeah. So man, I'm about to be in Louisville for like half this video, Hanging maybe over half this video. Yeah. So y'all just stay tuned. Yeah, stay so close. I got some uh, foam posit pros, probably 11 and a half. That's the crimson. Let's see, size 10. Yeah, this is the crimson. Um, they pretty warm, but they in good. They in solid condition, but they pretty warm. And I'm not gonna lie to you, but the foams though, condition. they take that pound. Yeah, they take a pound, and man, you could be. I know it's this big dude at my job. <laughs> He'll wear them and they don't even cave over, man. That's they're durable as hell. Like real talk. Mm -hmm. So uh, I got the crimson foams. Um, I think it's size 10. I told y'all so size 10. So Lucy's, Louisville, Illinois. You know it. You've been rolling another orange box. Rolling, I'm rolling, I'm rolling. What you got? We got oh, some I rainbow the brights. Girl. Wholesale. These are the fly knit runners, yep. This Those is a size sell. 11 and a half, like a whole bunch of the shoes that we get. So make sure if you're size 11 and a half, you fool with us, check the links below in the description. That's where we sell all the shoes. Let's check the condition real quick. These looking brand new, maybe worn once or tried on. These rainbow fly knit racers, size 11 and a half with the box. Racing on them. Yeah. Them boys look brand new though. They do. They just yeah, look maybe yeah. unlaced, maybe tried on, because yeah, I don't yeah. see any dirt on the bottom. That's, so that's, that's a nice cool. look come up, man. Mm -hmm. Well, I got a pair of Jordan 3, um, uh, a pair of blues. Yep. Yeah. So, what size are these? 
eight and a half, small size. These are little foot. Yeah, solid use condition. Um, going for sale soon. These. Definitely going for sale soon. Not much to talk about with these, but uh, loose no box, and that's gonna probably be with my next. Probably five pair of shoes. <laughs> Hanging out in Louisville. I'm gonna get it going with my boxed items over here. Got some of these. These are some KDs in a very funky colorway. Got some green glow swoosh and some kind of glow spots all over the place. And this is the the Tar Heels kind of like burnt orange colorway. That's where he went to college at. Yeah, he KDs. went to Texas. Yep. Mm -hmm. These are a good use condition. This is that size 11. So you can let me know if you need these. Going for sale, usually for low. These KDs, they don't hold too much value, but they're nice hooping shoes, you know, looking cool on the court. Mm -hmm. So you can grab these size 11. So I'm gonna go right on with these KDs since I can see everything. KD moment. Yeah, these are the fours, I believe. KD yep. fours, if I'm not mistaken. Size nine, um, I'm not sure about the exact colorway, but I know they're fours, but. Um, Funky colorway. I don't know if they were the Nerf ones. I don't think they're the Nerf ones though, but um, these are the KD4s. So, so almost like a, it's not really OKC blue, but it could be, I don't know. But size nine, KD4s. Going for sale. Look like a marine type of blue. Yeah, it is. So they in solid use condition. They've been hooped in. Look like. So. Them KDs. All right over on this side, orange Nike box. Let's get right into it. Let's see. It's another pair of them road racers. Nike Straight flying up. eraser. Yeah, these are pretty Those cool. Are like the Oreo this is that size 11. Too. Yep, Oreo, the black and white. Oreo. These are looking brand new dead stock. Man. No dirt on the bottom. That's straight. Those be selling. Those are gold. Yep. Size 11. Road racers. Flying in racers. This is a very light shoe. Very, very light. Even double box style. This is still like less than two pounds. The whole shoe, the whole pair of shoes in the Nike box, in a double box. I know when I ship them, they're still like two pounds or less. So yeah, that's cool are. on a shipping price for me. Size 11. Oreo. Let me know. All right. So. Loose. Loose, Looseville. Man, this is the most Looseys I've had ever. So these are the Charlotte Hornet uh, Jordan 10s. Yeah, be like that sometimes. Yeah, that's cool though, as long as the shoes are they good though. Size of these, these are five Why? So these are even smaller. Little feet the heat. Smallest. But little feet heat, like he said, Charlotte Hornets. Barely rocked, um, just clean the bottoms up a little bit. But it's not no creasing or nothing, so. That retro 10 you know city pack. That. You know, any of your kids need it. They here. The little feet. Ready for sale. Yep. Gonna pull another pair of those Lucy's. Yeah, Try to get you just rolling keep out loose. Rolling, man, man cause cause I still got this is oh, crazy. Got, so got this, heat, this is decent though. I actually sold yeah, these these are the shadow. Yep. Shadow ones. Short number one shadow, yeah, so black these and gray. Pretty worn though. These are five use also, like the last pair. But these Size definitely five nice. Wide. I love these colorways, man. This colorway right here. Definitely so. black and gray. And then so, you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and do this last loose right. build, man. Those shadows ahead. come out again this year, yeah, 2018. Yeah, I heard. I heard about later that. in the year, so get those for sale as soon as possible. So I got these Jordan 15s. These 15s are the OG colorway. Which with the chokehold on them. These are the newer release. This is the 2016 release. This is size 12, so it's not like it's the OG release. You know? Somebody throw them in a the sleeper hold. Yeah. With them tight, tight laces. Yeah, going to show that sleeper hold on them tight laces. Damn. That's Not to the, loosen those. I knew this dude in high school, they used to tie shoes like that and bounce on his toes. We <laughs> roasted him. <laughs> those might have been his That is, that's know. his stuff. <laughs> what you call it again, though? Yeah, that choke hole. That cho <laughs> <laughs> that's that choke hole. You crazy. Put them in a sleeper. Yeah, they did. They, I mean, but these are durable, man, too. But they, uh, they're in all right condition, but... They definitely lace hard. I will. Look at that one even more. They touching. They almost touching yeah, though. Both sides totally are touching, closed. Jack. Damn. No room to breathe in those ones. They might have been like a size. This is a size 12. They might have wore like a size 10 though, and they just they yeah. couldn't do it no more. Chokehold. Mm -hmm. Out there. But yeah, that's my last loose pair. I still got. Damn, I still got some more shoes. All right, I'll, I'll get some popping on this side. Yeah. Though, and the next thing you can pull two, so we're more even. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, all them Lucy's. So, man, you get more pairs. That's cool, though. Yeah, that's true. More pairs to work with. Right. That's I got some about. fusions. Pulled them out fusion. the whole fusion box. I had. I knew what they were as soon as I see them because I mess with the fusions. Yeah. Had that outer right. shell box. This is the threes. Oh, three. I can't say these are my favorite, but I'm about to show them off. I'm not even sure if I've seen this specific colorway. This is like a linen. 
Yeah. Weird material. Like brown. Khaki kind of colorway. Let's see what it says on the box. Reed. Dark oak. White and medium brown. Reed. Yep. Uh, Shout out to Reed. I know you're watching. It's the Reed colorway. It's got some cool details on here. Just that, you know, weird fibers and stuff. Different. Yeah. Different details. Like different. you said, it do look like a linen. It look like it's cotton on the inside. What is the interior? Right, some different textures uh -huh. going on for sure. Blue Jumpman. Looking, looking DS too. Those might looking be Looking DS. Too. Check the Jumpman with the air on the back. This is the Jordan 3 Fusion. This is like an Air Force One, but fused with the Jordan 3. So that's why I got the 3 back. Got the elephant print cement on the toe in the back. And the condition looking dead stock. So hopefully these are very rare catch a good price for these or something but most of the fusions they don't go for too high no. so they going for sale one way or another this is that size 10 with the box the fusions i ain't even seen these ones before so that's yeah. pretty exclusive brand new dead stock size 10 let me know you yeah, know I, I never saw those i never really messed with fusions too much but the 12 obviously that was a popular fusion and yep. the fives were cool yeah that's my two favorite are, ones for sure cool. there's a couple other good ones but that was I the best still got some more boxes Nike uh, Tech Challenge mm -hmm. too. Are these some high Agassiz? Agassiz? Yeah. yeah. I never seen this colorway though, Andre but I don't know. I, looking at this box. A, they had a couple of different special editions of those. USA yeah. is probably like the USA, USA Open or something like that. Oh, okay. One of those tennis competitions. I know they had like the Wimbledon ones or something. Special yeah. edition. Andre it's the red, white, and blue. What size are these? I just thought it's size 12, so I'm getting to some 12s now. Big size 12. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So these are in good solid condition. Yeah, those right, look like let me show y'all what they got. Up. You got you got a couple of different laces in. Hold on, you got sticker. Nike Lab version. So that's yeah. what's going on with those. Nike Lab is probably like a lab version of those Tech Challenge. Right. Yeah. So you get two of them. You got a baby blue lace, powder blue, looking like you go with the jacket. And you got a red one, red laces. It's already white ones in there. Those so, USA colors. Yeah, red, white, and blue. Anyway. USA. And I'll just show y'all the USA since this is where we at, where we from, on the back. USA. USA. I do like this on the on the on the lace right here. Yeah. That's like the tennis court Nike symbol. I like that though. Yeah. Just zoom in on it. Show yeah, them. I like that, That's the man. tennis court symbol. Like if you look at it, it's a tennis court and it got the swoosh. Yeah, y'all can see that. Yep. Got so, some keychains that look like that and stuff. These are straight. Feel that material though, man. That's a. Uh, I thought it was about to be a suede, yeah, but it's like, like a, premium. a. Yeah. It almost look like it. I don't know. It look like a tennis ball from a distance, but it's rough. It don't look like it looks like suede, but it's not. So, keep it moving. These are man. You don't run out, run out of room over here, man. I think you still are up a pair too, cause I only no, got I two over got here. I got three. I got three yeah, you more. Go ahead, bust one more out. Let's keep it rolling. So then we even. We got <laughs> way more pairs. A bunch of them was loose, but. I think I like this box. Hopefully, this is what I'm thinking it is. Ultra Boost. Boosting. My size, size 13. Big size. You know it. Oh, you got man, good solid condition. That's man. fire. All whites. I'm liking this though. Mm -hmm. So some all white boost size 13. You know what I'm saying? These are definitely for the boost heads, boosting. Um, show y'all both. Look warm maybe once or twice. Yeah. Very good this condition. Nice. Good condition though, man. So I'm happy with this. When I saw that box, I I instantly got. Not all the way up on the boost. I can't tell is that the all whites or the cream. It looks like it's cream, cause cause when I first saw it, I was like, dang, these might have been warm. But when you look at it, it's like a cream. Those might be the creams. Yeah, you can see it's like a cream, looking like French vanilla ice cream. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's a very nice one way or another. Them boosts. Yeah, I'm gonna throw them on top. Going man. for sale. Good. Doing the boost. Got They're two definitely pairs over sale. here. Oh man, I gotta make a choice. I'll roll with this one. This is a very cool box. Choosing. I yep, choosing. I know which it is. Oh. Gotta choose. Yeah. Time comes, you gotta right. choose. So this is a very cool box. One of a kind. It got the infrared black splatter all over it. Mm -hmm. And these are the Neymars. It got the Neymar behind the Jordan Jumpman right there. It got the black Jumpman, but it got the silver Neymar to right, go with it. Right. Those Let's are check. Cool. This is a big size 15. 15. These are the Neymar 5 Lows. It's gonna be an all 3M colorway. All silvery mm. metallic 3M. These are pretty crazy. I like these a lot. Some people don't like them. I actually like them a lot. Mm -hmm. I like them so much. I got like two, maybe two or three pairs of these in my Dose. size. Thres. All right. Those tres cuatros. Exactly. We getting them popping with these. This is the big old size 15, and these look worn one time. Yeah, man. They do. 
Yeah, so and fives run big, so that's looking like a 16. It's looking like a big old <laughs> battleship. Yeah, <laughs> but somebody got to rock them, and they will get <laughs> listed this and sold cover right. Our <laughs> it's covering our whole face. Y'all probably, I know y'all couldn't see me for a minute. Right. <laughs> we gone behind the size 15. Yeah. <laughs> so you can let me know if you need these Neymars with big foots. Size 15 with the box looking very good, very near dead stock. Big foots, no chokehold. Mm. No chokehold. Nope. Yeah, let me see. So I'm, I got to choose down here too. I'm gonna go in with choose. the Jordan box, man. See what Jordan, we got. I choose you. Yeah. Jordan 11. Okay. They lows. Let's see what, what we got. got. Oh, that's some fire. Some shit you like. Yeah, I like those like. a lot. <laughs> yeah, those are decent size 12. That's what the box says. I just want to make sure these are in real good condition, though. Man. Barely worn. Looks Barely worn once. Worn. Yeah, probably the ones. Just a little yellow around the traction pods, but that happens with 11s. That's very common. Mm. Even if you let them sit, you know, and don't wear them much. That happened with my cool gray 11s I had. Yep. And around them traction pods, it'll just start turning brown on you. So yep. these are barely rock, like he said, maybe a few times. Some minor creasing on the toe box. Very minor, but you're right. This is some fire, though. That's one of my favorite pairs of the Jordan 11 Lowe's. Yeah. I really want them in the mids. I can't wait for the mids. Yeah, I might even have to get a strange. custom pair or something because yeah. I've seen them before customized. For real? Yeah. In the mids? A mid, yep. Yeah, that's straight. I think you have a couple of pair of these, though. Yeah, I do. Yeah. I like those a lot. Tuxedos. Tuxedo. Yeah. Let me know if you need them. Yep. Links below for where we sell all the kicks. That was in true. case you forgot, I got this is my last box. This is Jordan Jumpman box size 12. What's that? Let's see what we got. We're looking dead stock. These are looking so Steel fresh and clean. Tins. Damn, they look dead tins. stock. These are looking brand new, size 12. Yeah, check out the look bottom. Crazy. Bottom's yeah. the coolest part. Bunch of the Damn. attributes from Jordan's career. A lot of cool stuff going on. These are definitely one of the best tens though. Mm -hmm. In Eight, the 10 fan. 87 scoring title, 88 dunk champ, 89 all defense, 1990 scores the 60 points and so on. A whole bunch of cool facts mm -hmm. on the bottom. It's the hot fire. It's one of the best tens I could think of. Yeah. Steel tens, white, gray, and black. Brand new dead stock, size 12. Let me know if you need them. On my last pair. Down to the last. Coney? Coney's. Save so, the Coney Islands for last. So I don't know much about these, but they looking premium. Yep. They are at the bottom of the box. They are dead stock with the laces. I will find out about these soon. But them being at the bottom of the box, they probably... Yep. It looks like price. kind of a limited edition yeah, box. Yeah, it's looking premium and limited, so not knowing much about it. The box is pretty cool, though. You're right. It's got that... It still all reminds me of the athlete's foot uh, logo though. Yeah, that you know, so foot with it, the wing. Yeah, foot with the wing. But uh, what size are these boys? Big. 13. My size. And they not, they're not keepers for me like the flu game. <laughs> <laughs> and big size 13. Big size 13. Conies. So, so they look, you got premium materials on them. That suede and everything though, so. And them conies are made nice. It's yeah. a nice shoe, a lot of nice materials on there. Durable. Somebody gonna need them though. They looking like they were worn maybe once. That's it. Well, the lace bag's still attached right here, so that's probably yeah, you're right. on. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, you're right, because this one looking not worn at all, so they knew. But that's that's finally it for this uh, bottomless box. <laughs> right. Yeah. Got you out of Looseville and on to the box items, mm -hmm. and we made it through this beater box battle. So. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for joining us. Thank you for supporting the channel. All the OG subs and the new ones, welcome to you. So we're going to go ahead and slide into the on feed heat. I'll kick it off. This is something I've been showed a few times, and it's all over the place right now. It's the Black Cement 3s. I got the, the unboxing review video. Hope you check that out. Gave it a thumbs up. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. If you enjoyed your time chilling with the Stone Cold Kicks crew, Mo Butters, and Rock'em Stock'em Kicks. Rock it's, my, em. it's my own feed heat. Been yeah. rocking them for a couple days. They're not even out yet. I'm gonna try to rock them as much as I can until the release date. And I'm, I might even do like an update video of like, you know, how the how the wear is looking on them, the wear and tear. Why not, right? Yeah, sure. So uh, my own feed heat. What you got? Looking at my jacket, you probably could tell what I'm rocking. You had to have some pennies Some on. kind of pennies, right? So these are the Flight Ones. His first shoe, like you know, you got the Penny Max ones. That was, that was his like second shoe, but it still had the one in it. But these are his flight ones. You see the one on the back, obviously. So I don't know if all y'all, most people do know, 
but what's real cool about this shoe is the black version. I, I had those. I don't have no more, but that's the only shoe Michael Jordan wore that was not a Jordan. MJ. When he was wearing 45 when he first came back, he threw these on. During but the game. But he cut this off, <laughs> which I don't blame him for, but he, he rocked them in the game, and I think they was playing Orlando, but he had the black ones, and uh, he rocked them. And they look, they were just different for him to throw on some right. nine Jordans. That's I still when, don't know the reason why he did that though. That's when Jordan and Penny, they were the top two people yeah. on Nike. So right, he just wanted right, to right. a little cross branding show Penny right. some love because he respected them a lot. Yeah, that was the only time he did it. But these are hot fire, man. These came out, like I said, about 94, 95, that season. And the OG release had, uh, they came out with white laces. You know, that's the only difference. This is the uh, 2013 release. This is the only time they retro them too. So once they came out, people definitely wanted this colorway the most. And uh, the black colorway is cool, but this is like the best colorway. Also like the, I think my favorite part of the shoe too is the pinstripes that's on the on the tongue. Cause you know, pinstripes was in Orlando uniforms and jerseys. He also had that on the penny ones. You know, the ones with like the eagle wing that y'all have seen all the time. Right, he kept pinstripe, that pinstripe. That pinstripe was on the, uh, the Jordan pack of the Jordan number seven. Oh yeah, 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 and that sevens. pack, that magic. That was on I think he played against games, Orlando yeah. on that one. Yeah, he did when he scored the 63, that was against Orlando. So that's my own fee heat, and in my opinion, this is heat, and I'm a Penny fan, so y'all probably see some more Pennies on the channel that I rock. That's my dude too, so. For sure. Anthony Penny Hardaway, OG, been a fan of him for a long time. Know so. it. So as always, thanks for tuning in to the Stone Cold Kicks channel where we got the beater box battles popping two at a time, all the time. Until next time, keep it locked.